Well, it all started when a workman was up there on the roof uh, in the fall of 2005 and uh, got to the end of his work and leaned on a dormer and the dormer moved six inches. Uh, generally speaking, that's not a very good sign. We found out that the job was going to be so huge that we were gonna to have to shut the buildings for 15 months. And at that point, I went to the trustees and said my recommendation ladies and gentlemen, then I let it sink in, is to restore the entire thing. And so $34 million and 15 unbelievably hectic months for the college, and behind me is the uh, stunning consequence of the work. Long Walk is a lot of different things to a lot of different people here on campus. It's a group of buildings. Um, on, the, on the outset, it's a group of buildings that houses students in a living environment in Jarvis, but then it's also a building that has the life and breath of Trinity for the academics. It's also about everything on campus. It, it really is kind of like a heartbeat. There's everything that you can imagine that can go on on a college campus happens in these buildings. People live there, they learn there, they party there, they socialize there, they're challenged, they have good times, bad times, you know, fits of laughter when they got an A and complete sadness and breakdown when they flunked. Um, so it, it really just is indicative of everything on campus. One of the great things about being in a place as beautiful as Trinity is that for one four-year period in your life, you're surrounded by beauty every day. So if you look here in the former chapel, you've got woodwork that you couldn't duplicate today to save your life. You have these magnificent oak and chestnut beams, and you have stained glass windows that are marbles that were completely covered by basically 140 years of coal dust, dirt, pollution, God knows what else, and now they are luminescent in the truest sense of the word and the students are awed.